Boy Scout Troop 335 in Greater Lafayette is finding new ways to come together and still practice social distancing. We spoke with the troop today about their idea to turn a gaming platform into a meeting platform. What we did was we set up a Discord server. It's a messaging platform, something commonly used for video gaming, but now it's being repurposed to hold scout meetings for Troop 335. We're trying to think of some way we could keep scouting going and also kind of get our youth engaged in some constructive activities. With the help of Cohen Schultz, all 52 members of Troop 335, who normally gather at St. Andrew's United Methodist Church, now come together virtually. I helped create the server. Um, me and Jack, we helped uh, make it what it is. We designed all the channels, made everything so that we can take ordinary meetings and just do them online. Schultz says Discord is a great platform for kids in this age group, which made it fitting for meetings. Discord is really popular among kids in the high school and middle school range, so I think that most of the kids knew how to use it already. So it was technology that we were all familiar with. Yeah. Advancing in Scouts is really important, so creating a platform where we can still advance is really helpful. The next step was to hold their weekly meeting, which is led by senior patrol leader Jack Crossley. And I just kind of um, keep the meetings running so that we aren't all just sitting in a channel just talking about random stuff. Their meetings start off with a presentation of the American flag and troop flag, announcements, and then awarding badges and advancements within the troop. It helps keep everybody knowing what's going on because this is how we've always run our meetings. So even though we're online, they still know what's going to happen next. This revised method of holding meetings is something troops say will help them in the future. I think that this will help their reputation a lot, just kind of getting people to move up in the ranks and having better people in the workplace and showing more leadership and discipline. Well, the Boy Scouts of America Sagamore Council is also offering several resources to families, including cyberbullying and recognizing and responding to child abuse. Families can learn more about those services linked to this story on our website.